going on guys? Lops and Lops are here coming in for the first time to join you on YouTube. Uh, so yeah, it should be a fun little channel just to hang out and play a few games and such. Um, and just answer a few comments here and there, but really I'm just doing this for fun, you know? Uh, so yeah, let's go ahead and get started. We're going to be playing today's Scum, single player mode. Uh, yeah, just figuring out what we want to do here first. Let's see. So I'm gonna name, go ahead and name my guy Thud. Thud. Because, well, why not? I don't really see why not. And, uh, we got an H limit here. I, I, I kind of feel like... So, I played this game a little bit already, so I gotta basically understand how to play this game fairly decently. I never gotten too far into it, though, so I like to uh, get deeper into it. Now, I feel like 30 is around a good age, but I feel like... Okay, so I think the numbers are pretty balanced. It just depends on what age you're going to start with. It depends what you get. So if I start off at 50, I get plus intelligence, plus constitution, no bonuses. But if I start off younger, yeah, see, I'm not that smart, but I'm, I'm more dexterous and uh, have more strength. So, I don't know. I think I'm going to go ahead and start with 30. Um, head type, I don't know. I like how a head type controls whether you're black or not. But, uh... <laughs> Uh, let's go ahead and, uh, I think we're gonna go choose, choose this guy. This guy, you know, I'm, I, I kind of relate to him, I don't know why. So, <laughs> I see your genitalia affects your attributes, I'm sure a lot of you know that. So, I, I mean, I'm really decent at this game, but I, I kind of feel like your genital size kind of affects on gameplay a bit, like, how much more stronger, like, smallest is easy mode, largest is hard mode. <laughs> oh, oh my god. This guy's, this guy himself gets bigger. Um, <laughs> you know, I'm gonna go ahead and put it at two inch. I'm assuming those are inches. Um, and yeah, this is pretty good, so let's go ahead and move on and go on to the... Uh, skills. Now, I know I love using rifles and handguns. That's a personal preference. Uh, melee weapons, I know I should probably put at least a basic in because, you know, everyone uses melee weapons in this when they first start. So I'm going to go ahead and put the rest into rifles and handguns because I don't personally use a lot of archery. I love archery. I think it's a cool ass thing to use, but uh, I'd much rather use um, weapons in this, or guns in this game. Running and endurance, you know, so these things, I always figure these things just kind of go hand in hand, so I just kind of always kind of put them 50 50 split, you know. And uh, dexterity skills. Demolitions, we're not really, I'm not exactly sure if it works for each single person. And stealth, I imagine it's pretty good, so especially when dealing with the later people in the game, such as sentries, I mean, not people. Uh, driving is, I imagine, super important. So, you know, because I don't want to wreck um, vehicles as I find them. And intelligence skills. Engineering. I find engineering very important. But I keep thinking, I think engineering just affects on how well you fix stuff, though. But I'm not 100% sure. If you guys go ahead and leave a comment below. In fact, actually, if you go ahead and hit that subscribe button, that'd be great. But, uh, we're going to go ahead and put the rest in and sniping, I think, because, you know, actually, no, I don't know what awareness is, so I'm not 100% where that is, so I'm gonna, um, I, um, I'm just gonna put the rest in survival, because I don't know what survival is, so I want to see what that's, that's like, um, okay, uh, that, I think that's all our skills, yeah, so let's go ahead and jump right into it. That's beautiful, yes. All right, so let's go ahead and get started. All right, guys, we are in the game. Now, Secure oh, communication oh. with human asset established. Greetings, human asset. Welcome to Scum Island tutorial protocol provided by the Tech One Corporation. My designation is Dual Energetic Entity Neural Appliance Ardina. I am an artificial intelligence. 
accounts created by the Tech One Corporation tasked with overseeing the scum show protocols including the preparation of human assets. If you wish to activate the tutorial please do so on your journal interface. Secure channel closed. All right, so you just saw that. That's like the little beginner tutorial thing. I, I'm not. I'm gonna go ahead and skip that because I've been playing for a while now. I'm not great, but you know I got a basic understanding. Uh, I see we started off in the stone biome, which isn't great, and we're actually next to the uh, to the air base, which isn't great either. So I don't know. I kind of feel like we need to start heading out, but I there's not really much cities around us. We might actually die right off the start. Which ain't good. Uh, I think we're just gonna go ahead and try to head down the mountain for sure. Ooh, mushrooms. For sure, we're gonna head down the mountain first. Cause, uh, we have, we don't, we're not prepared for this. We are not prepared for this at all. We are definitely not prepared, prepared for. I kind of feel like this one's poisonous. I actually haven't eaten this one yet. I'm gonna eat it anyway, see what happens. Can I die? No? Apparently it was good. Alright, so, uh. Yeah, so the first thing we're gonna be doing is getting down the mountain, because, uh, that. This. This is no bueno. We. If we go over here, we can see our temperatures and stuff, and we can see the. T um, we're slowly dropping in temperature. So. We're gonna go ahead and leave the mountain as fast as we can. See if we can't warm up a little bit so we don't freeze to death. Hopefully we don't get... See, if you look right here, we got sicknesses. And eventually, you see hypothermia in there. If we get hypothermia, that's... Uh, ooh, I'm not jumping that... Oh, no. Nope, no, 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 no. Yeah, we don't want to get hyperthermia, that's for sure. I don't want to die. A little too early to be dead. A little jump down. Yeah, that that won't hurt. There we go. So, one of the first things you're usually supposed to do is create a backpack, but right now might not be a good idea to create a backpack. Sorry, I keep hearing something. I don't know what that is. Ah, uh, yes. Okay, so we're getting to more lustful green. That's... This is way better. And look, there's a small village. This is... Alright, it's starting to look up. It's starting to look up. Um, I'm not sure how... What the temperature is out here. It might be a good idea to make a backpack or something now so we can defend ourselves. Um, you know what? I think I'm going to build, um, build a rock knife. Cut, cut up some stuff and... Uh, is that enough rock? Oh, snowball. Huh. Alright, so I'm gonna get, uh, make a stone knife. Stone knife. And uh, I'm gonna go ahead and make a uh, spear, I think. Using the stone knife. So we can go ahead and take this and... Uh, you know, actually I think since we're getting out of the snow biome, we might be able to just go ahead and cut cut up our uh, some clothing to actually make um, a backpack. That might be a good thing to do right now. Ooh, right there. That's a. It looks like a grocery store, I think. A little convenience store or something. Go ahead and check that out. See what's up. See if there's anything good. Hopefully, there's something good down there. Hopefully. And that's a bear, isn't it? That is a bear in our way, gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. I'm going to, uh. I'm gonna leave him alone, I think. And I'm gonna take my long stick and cut it into tiny sticks way up here as I stare at him down there. This is kind of bad. Because he's right in the way towards where we need to go. Maybe if we, by the time we finish, he'll move out of the way and go down there. Be pretty nice. We'll, we'll run around this side, that's for sure. Uh, let's see. We're gonna cut our underwears into rag. Yes, our underwears. 
God, it must be sucking this to be in a situation where you have to cut your underwears to do this. It gave us two rags, so instead of cutting our shirt, we're going to have to cut our socks. So that we can only get one more rag. And then we can make a backpack, which would be nice. Okay. Uh, crafting. We can go down here. Courier backpack. Oh, come on. There we go. Great. So now we got the carrier backpack, and now we can actually take our long wooden stick here and make a spear. I don't think that spear's gonna do much with that uh, bear, though. But uh, it'll definitely be helpful down there with the zombies. That's 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 a lot, for sure. If you look down there, you can actually see the airfield from here. It's actually really close. It'd be nice to get in there. All right. So we got a backpack now. So much more space, by the way. Oh, yeah, that's right. That's right. That's right. I'm going to come back here and get my long stick. And uh, let's see. We'll go to crafting. One, oh, improvised wooden spear. There we go. Okay. I wonder if I could do stone spear. I don't know. Improvised stone spear. Ah, yeah, I could have. But it, it, it's, it's all right. It, it would have been a lot more work than would, than would have been worth. So we're just going to go ahead and pick that up and keep that with us. And I think we're going to leave everything else here. Now, where's that bear? I don't know. I don't want to deal with that bear, guys. I, I really don't want to deal with that bear at all. So I'm going to go ahead and jump around this area here. Run around the other side. Ooh, mushroom. Just keep eating mushrooms. Yeah. If, for, you, for those of you who don't know, you really need to eat a lot of mushrooms when you first start the game. Because you come over here... This is all your uh, vitamins and stuff. Not looking so good. Definitely not looking so good. Okay, I, I still don't see where that bear is. It's kind of making me nervous. Is that a guy? I think there's a zombie down there. Or is that a tree? I can't tell. It looks like, like a tree and a zombie. Oh, I got a scratch. Oh, yeah, that's better. All right. So if we come down here, okay, is that a zombie? No, that's a tree. That's a tree. Okay. I'm getting worried there. Did I forget my rock? No, I still got it. All right. So in here, we should be able to find some food here to help us, you know, fuel up for our great journey here. Just a heads up, guys. I am not the greatest player. Oh, fireworks. But, uh, you know, I, I, I enjoy some tips and stuff, you know, to figure out how to get better at this game. I really do enjoy this game a lot. Um, I've only been playing it for maybe, like, three days now only. And I haven't been playing for it um, a whole bunch, you know. I don't spend a lot of time, a lot of time on it. But, uh, for the most part, you know, I, I, I've been, I enjoy some people. Oh, hey, look, a zombie. So, if it's one, you know, it's really not that bad when you have to deal with one. But when it's a lot more than one... It's, it's a lot more horrible, you know. Man, this guy's not going down. Okay, there we go. So, we'll just go ahead and go look, have a look around here, see if there's anything good. We got or we already got a shirt, which is nice, so... Or we're getting more clothing and stuff. We see what's in our vicinity. A rubber band. Uh, I'm not exactly sure we'll do that. Pineapple. Oh, how much is the pineapple? Does it taste good? Slightly off. You know, I'm going to go ahead and eat it and see what happens. Let's see. Mm, I don't seem to be dying from it, so... Go ahead and... I'm going to go ahead and take this shirt, put it down on the floor. So, that looks like a gun. It's a shotgun. Do you hear that? I think that's a deer. I'm pretty sure that's a deer. So that, so this is nice. We already got a shotgun. So this is, we're doing pretty well. Let's see, is there anything else in it? There's no ammo. Can we check ammo? Yeah, there's nothing in here. So uh, we're gonna go ahead and keep this on our back. Man, it's only at 34%. That's not very good. We need to find... Uh... So in this game, there's this gun cleaning kits that are very useful. We're going to have to put that on the floor. And uh, can we... Yeah. 
Um, so there's gun cleaning kits on this game that can clean your gun um, all the way up. So it's completely useful. Because there's a lot of malfunctions on these uh, rifles and stuff. <laughs> And uh, the, when they malfunction, you get like a stove top. If, if you guys shoot, um, any of y'all shoot a lot, you know, you know what I mean. But the stove top is like when a bullet doesn't leave the, the chamber all the way, or the receiver all the way. And it kind of just sticks out from the side, blocking it from the next bullet going in. So, yeah, that's that's one of the issues, you know, you're having when you got some of these low quality guns. But, uh... I'm, I'm, I'm sure it's not going to be that big of a deal, especially since we don't have any ammo, so we'll be mostly using the spear for right now. But until then, you know, we're, we're going to need to figure out um, whether we're going to be using it. Because I feel like we're going to have to only use that if we are in an emergency. Like when we shoot that, oh, there's going to be so many of them coming. Got some fingerless gloves. Oh, that's what I put on. Cool. Let's see, let's see. Is there anything good in this house? Batteries, uh, okay, so a lot of people don't know, but batteries can be used to charge um, the batteries and accept the car just slightly. It's very weird. I don't know why, they, but it, you can charge it just ever so slightly. What's in here? What's in here? Uh, flint and steel. Piece of rubber. I don't know how I built fail about the fire, guys. I mean, you know, I, I played the game for a while. I never really had a use for fire, so. Then again, only three days, so you know, I'm mean, gonna have it really need it much. All right, let's get going. Keep going. going keep searching. I all right. So I don't even know if there's gonna be a like a real goal to this series or at all. I'm just gonna kind of keep playing unless you guys want like a natural goal. Maybe we could try to work towards. Maybe we could like try to go because okay, i know there's like a 50 cal barrett on here i think they call it like the antimatter antimatter gun oh a bushman okay that's good that is good it's at 82 percent too that is good but yeah so there's a uh there's a barrett 50 cal which they call the anti antimatter gun and it's used to destroy sentries, which are these giant robot mechs things. I'm not sure if it's the same with piloting them. I think they're just robots, but uh... I want to check this house to make sure there's just no zombies in it first before I go searching. Okay. And so, I was wondering, you know, maybe it might be a good idea to... Uh, no, not kick. It might be a good idea to see if maybe the end goal to be... You see if we could take one of those guys down or something. I don't know. It's up to y'all, really. Alright, put that down. Uh, did I drop my spear? No, my spear's up in my back. Ooh, some nice pair of J's here. But yeah, let's put on some underwear since we lost our last ones. Uh, this is a nice shirt. But my shirt's better. We're gonna go ahead and put these on. Get rid of our old trainer shoes. Go head upstairs, see what's up we got upstairs. Make sure there's no zombies just hanging up here. Uh, so yeah. Ooh, go down. Come on. So yeah, if you guys got an idea of what maybe the end goal should be, then just go ahead and leave it in the comments down below. Uh, compound bow sight. Uh, you know, that's pretty good for a lot of people. But for me, it's not really that great. I... Halloween mess now. I don't, I, I don't know if I, how I feel about that. Uh, yeah, I'm not really a bow guy personally myself. Is that a... No, okay. Yeah, I'm not a bow guy myself personally. I personally like using rifles and stuff instead. Pistols, just guns in general. Some people... That's really good. We, we could get rid of this spear now, actually. Just... <laughs> you... What? Okay. Um... Yeah, so we're gonna go ahead and take this axe as our main weapon. It's not as good, but it can, it can use a little help. But uh, it's still really good. This thing's an amazing weapon and tool, guys. So it's fairly lucky to find that as well. Now, if we can find a hiker's backpack, we would be set. I mean, this would be perfect. Can't ask for a better uh, start. Okay. 
Okie dokie. Go in here. Jeans. Okay, we're gonna take these just down, put this, equip this, put these back in. There we go. Uh, go ahead and start switching the house. There. Okay, no. Da -da 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 -da. Got some water. 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 Uh, yeah, so a lot of this game is just really searching. You know, I noticed that this game is just mostly about searching for items that you need. I mean, I kind of wish there was more of a little bit of a story to this, too. You know, like a little bit of a lore for me to, you know, just see what happened. Maybe understand why there's a bunch of, you know, prisoners on this island and stuff. I don't know. It's just me personal. I don't know. I, I, I like to know. Alright. Keep going. Keep going. Now, I have never messed with some of these sentries down below. I'm not sure how many of y'all actually, you know, tried them. But, uh... If you, if you have, go ahead and let me know, because uh, I, I, is there like a special way? Can you kill them? Is there a special way you could kill them or something? I like to. I wonder if, I wonder if they drop like any like rare guns or something. That would be kind of cool. Okay. This a lot of searching. Lots and lots of searching. Oh, yes. I want this. I want this mask. I definitely want this mask. That's a very nice mask. Love playing. I love plate doctors. I actually have my own plate doctor costume just for fun. I was actually wearing it for the residence, but you know, since this Corona thing happened, I kind of, I, I kind of don't want to go to the residence there because I, I feel like everybody's gonna be a plate doctor there now. You know, like last year, I, I, I bought it last year, and so I was so upset when this plague happened. Everybody wants to, um, and now everybody, I'm pretty sure, wants to be a plate doctor down at the residence fair. Uh, so, oh, military boots that are all covered in peace signs and flowers. So lovely. Uh, what can ninety percent? That's good. And it has uh extra spacing on them. That's nice. That's really good. Pretty good. Pretty good. Uh, do we check everything? We check everything here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Got this. Okay. What's next? What's next? Still no vehicle. It'd be nice if there was a vehicle. What's in here? What's in here? Any zombies? No zombies? Okay. Okay, this is uh Okay, this is pretty good, but uh we can't take it. That sucks. We're just gonna have to deal without it for a while, which blows, but it is what it is. And fireworks. Okay. What's in here? I've been through here. Okay. Um. Keep going down this way. See, we're getting awfully close to this military base, and I really want to go, but honestly, I'm really scared. Oh, I've been through here. I am really scared to get to that military base. Oh, my cat just means bless you. Zombies, we're good. Yeah, so that military base scared. Oh my god. <laughs> we are in really good shape, guys. Really good shape. We got a gun. Granted, no ammo, but still, we got a gun. We got a knife. We got an axe. And now, we get the Hypers backpack. I mean, just look at that space difference. So much better. I. Mm. Okay. I. I mean, now if if car was to spawn like right now, I. I, I, the scum gods would be looking down upon us. I mean, for right now, they definitely are looking down upon us right now, for sure. But to add a cherry on top of all this, 
There'd be a car, man. Then we'd be pretty much set. Be oh, just about ready to go out and go straight to that, uh, deal with those sentries, maybe even. I don't know. Oh! <laughs> that scared me a little bit. I didn't notice he was in here. Two hits. And that was me hitting him on the back. I didn't, you know? If I hit him on the head with this, probably one hit. Yeah, this axe makes the load of world a difference. Rope, that's pretty good. It's always good to have rope. Never know what you're gonna make. I don't really like searching these hay bales because it's usually just feathers, you know? There's not, not a whole bunch lot in them. But, uh. Alright. Oh, I guess. Is there a roof in this one? Yeah, not really. Alright. I think this is about it for this town. Now, if I go over here and open this, is that an egg? Any eggs? No, just feathers. Okay, so over here, there are sentries, but there's also bases full of weapons and stuff. So the question is, is it worth for me to risk to run in there and try to catch everything? Now, is there even any sentries around me? Oh, yeah, there's some sentries. Yeah, I see these guys right here. Yeah. Uh, let me let me go ahead and see if I can put this back up. There we go. No. Nope. All right. Look at that. Now, those guys are scary. They are really scary. And there's a lot of them here, too, which sucks. I, uh, I don't know how we get past them in this case. There's some zombies too. It might be better for me to come back later with a pistol and a silencer so I can take out the zombies easily. I don't know, guys. Yeah, you know what? I think I'm going to go ahead and head towards this town over here at B1. And see what I can do over there. I'm going to stay on the road because I'm kind of worried about the animals. Lots of the animals here, you know. There's wolves, bears. Wars. I mean, you saw the bear earlier. It's it's not fun, guys. It's not fun. Well, it's actually a lot of fun getting scared by them, but still. Alright, so I think I'm just going to keep um, running, and if anything interesting happens, I'll get back to y'all. I gotta say, that military base, though, is quite enticing. It makes me really want to go in there, you know? So, uh, I'm running along the side of the, of the Air Force Base now. Not really interested in going in, but kind of just curious more just to see what's in here. And I'm running towards the entrance for some reason. And I'm inside the base now. And I don't see any sentries it's over here. So, this is my first time here. I'm not exactly sure I like being here. It kind of makes me feel scared. I feel anxious, you know? I feel really anxious to be here. And I'm hungry, apparently. I already ate the pineapple, if you guys haven't noticed, but, uh... Yeah, I'm not. I'm not gonna do this. I'm gonna keep going. I'm gonna go to the what you call the other town. See if I can't get a vehicle or something. Maybe see if there's any like guns or something. Maybe some ammo and all that. That'd be really, really nice. I don't know. I don't know, guys. That's scary. I really want to get that car ready, tell you much, that much. You know, how much easier our life should be if we had a car. And, uh, is this... What, what is this? This ain't a town, is it? No, this ain't a town. Is this where we're heading towards? That ain't no town. 
That's a compound. Oh, that's definitely a compound. So... Okay, so I guess we're not going there either, because there's sentries all over that, I bet. We are... gonna starve, aren't we? <laughs> we're just gonna have to keep running, I guess. See if we can't uh, find mushrooms along the way. Hey guys, you see that? Right there. That's a hunter stand. Those hunter stands are pretty good, actually. If we could get, um, let's go ahead and go over there, check that out. We might be able to find a rifle or something to use. Oh, do we have a water bottle? No, I don't have a water bottle on me right now. Oh, wait, I do, I do. But. Alright, so if we get a... I know if we get a water bottle. Come down to crafting. I don't know rise. No, I don't need that. Uh, crafting. Oh, see, we got improvised bottle suppressor. So, if we could get some duct tape, we can actually make a suppressor, too. And then we could use that. And we could probably go inside of the uh, compound right away. Or these over here. And get some items, perhaps. Ah, I'm not sure. This is... I, I, I gotta say, it's kind of a ballsy move to do this right off the bat when you spawn, I think. I don't know. Maybe some of these more experienced scum players played it. And, you know, are perfectly fine with it, but... I, I, I don't know, I feel kind of uncomfortable doing it right off the bat. Let's go ahead and see what's what's up here. Alright, let's see, let's see. Climb. Please tell me there's something good. Please tell me there's something good. Please tell me there's something good. Oh, I don't think there's anything. Oh, hey, never mind. There is something pretty good. A Tech M9. Tech 01 M9. Okay, that's pretty good. Pretty good. Uh, okay, so our vitamin D is low, low. I'm gonna head take off the Halloween mask. See, we can't try to get some more vitamin D. But, oh, man. It would be nice if it was a hunter up here with, with the, the ammo. The Tech 9, that's still pretty good, man. Now, if we can find a magazine, some 9 mil, that'd be great. Unfortunately, though, we're over here. So, we're going to kill down. Wait. Is there a supply drop? <laughs> There's a supply drop dropping over here. And we're in single player mode, so... The most thing we have to worry about is zombies. So if, if it attracts any zombies or anything... What's that down there? How do, I, how do I put this up? I don't know how you put that up. I don't know how you... There we go. I, I don't know. Alright. I'm hungry, yes, I know. Alright, so let's go ahead and... Oh yeah, there's definitely, if there's an airdrop coming over, we're definitely heading over there. Especially with the Hydra's backpack, ooh, mushroom. Especially with the Hydra's backpack, we are going to be living it up if we could get in there. There's going to be guns, there's going to be food, there's going to be extra stuff, blah 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 blah. So yeah. Definitely need some food, that's for sure. There it is, guys. I didn't even notice. It's so beautiful. But let's take a rest real fast. I don't know. I don't know if like sitting down would uh, or maybe laying down makes it fill up faster. Oh, I think it is. I think it fills it up way faster. So take a run, lay down for a second. Nice. That cloud right there kind of looks like Africa. With, with some arms. See right here? You guys arm there, arm there. Africa doing a light ballet dance. Oh, wait, I'm already full. Alright, so let's keep going. Keep running. We're almost there. Almost there. What, what's that over there, though? Are we going up towards something? 
Something like we're running out towards something. Wouldn't it be great if we just landed right at a military base? Oh my god, they landed in a cornfield. That really sucked because I think these things explode or something, don't they? I'm pretty sure I've seen or heard these things explode. What? What? What is all this? What are these numbers? I, I'm confused. Does anyone know what these numbers are? Okay. I don't, I, I don't know. I gotta, I gotta open this up though, and I have to get that stuff. So let's go ahead and search this. Okay, got car repair kit. A car battery of 1% battery. Are you kidding me? Okay. Uh, a car repair kit. That's pretty good. We'll take that. That's for sure. Open this. Food. Yes. We're going to definitely need all the food we can. So we'll just keep bringing it in here. I really wish you... Can you like grab a bunch like that and then drag it all at once? No, you can't. That really sucks. Doing this one by one really gross. Alright. What's in here? What's in here? Box of nails. Don't need that. Yes, this is what we need. Oh my god, yes, this is exactly what we need. This is more than I actually expected. MP5 suppressor. Can we not put a red dot on this? That sucks. Oh, wait. A rail? Okay. And then we're going to put that here. We're going to take this, put this on there. Oh my god. Guys, we are looking good. I mean, I can't... Ooh, I never actually had an MP5 before. Ooh, toolbox, yes. We're gonna take this toolbox. Open this. Medicines and stuff. Yeah, guys, I never had a toolbox before. It's pretty interesting. I wonder what I wonder what it's like. Okay. Okay. I think that's everything besides this stuff. Uh we don't need the stuff, I don't think. Yeah, okay. I think we're good here. Ooh, guys, look at that. Let's see, can we examine it? No, we can't just like, look at it. But look at that. That's nice. That is nice. So what is this? Is this like a shooting range? Yeah, this is a shooting range. I don't know, guys. Are you, do you think we're ready to go in already? <laughs> I, I don't know. I kind of feel a little confident, actually, to go in. I mean, it would really suck, though, if we could get all this stuff and suddenly, you know, we die. That would really blow. But, uh, I don't know. Um. Hmm. Okay, well, one thing for sure is I want to run away from that thing. So those things, I, like I said, I'm pretty sure they explode or throw out gas or something. They do something after our time. Am I going farther away from it? No. This has to be like towards over here, right? This is where the stream begins, way down here. I don't know. I'm not gonna run into a sentry out here, am I guys? Uh, let's take a break and have something to eat. Uh, I think there was... Was there an MRE? Yeah, there was an MRE. Let's go ahead and eat that. There we go. Now we're getting some food in us. I. Guys? Is. No. No, we can't be this lucky. Uh uh. Uh uh. Is this. Oh, I said we're good. Guys, oh my god. Oh, okay, I think we, I think we literally got, I think this is good, I think. No, we can't be this lucky. <laughs> well, first thing first, I gotta, I gotta urinate, that's for sure, so. The bathroom here. Get the restroom. Alright guys. Uh, I think we're going to leave this off here for right now. Thank you for watching. Uh, go ahead and hit the like and subscribe button if you haven't already. You can keep, you know, keep in contact when I post the next uh, new video out. Uh, 
I, I think we're with, with this truck we might be ready to head on to the airbase next um next video i don't know uh all right guys so i'll see you in the next one